Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I created this big wing, big lashes, smoky eye look that I think goes really well when you wear glasses because it's all emphasis on the eyes. So yeah, if you want to see how I got this look, continue watching. So starting off with a bare face, moisturize, cleanse, all of that. I am first going in with the shade Blonde from the Urban Decay Gwen Stefani palette and I am placing this on my brow bone. I'm then going in with the shade Stark and this is going to be my transition shade. Then on the same fluffy brush I'm going in with the shade Anaheim and deepening my crease. The last colour we're using today is the darkest colour and it's called Punk and I am just going to define the outside of my crease and bring this down to the outer of my lid. I'm then going in with the shade Pop and on my finger just pressing this into the inner corner of my eyelid. I'm then going to do my eyeliner with my Skinny Marker by NYX. I'm then going to apply my Horizon Lashes. These are really big and really fluffy and just amazing. <laughs> I'm then going in with my Smashbox Photo Finish Primer, this is the green one to counteract redness and just applying this all over my face. I'm then going to go in with some MAC Fix Plus, this is the charged water one and it's great for dry skin so I'm just going to uh, spray this all over my face before I put my foundation on and I'm then going to go in with my NYX Correcting Palette and just colour correct some of the redness I have in my face. Go in with my MAC Studio Fix Fluid in the shade NC15 and apply this all over my face. Then going in with my Born This Way concealer and applying this under my eyes, down the bridge of my nose, my cupid's bow and my forehead. And I'm then going to buff this in with my Real Techniques sponge. I'm then going to set under my eyes with my Coty Airspun Powder. I'm then going in with this Butter Bronzer by Physicians Formula and it smells absolutely amazing. <laughs> and I'm just going to bronze up my cheekbones and my forehead. I'm then going in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit with the middle contour shade and on a slanted contour brush I'm just going to cut out my cheekbones. I'm also going to contour my nose. I'm then going to bake under the contour with that same Coty Espan powder. I'm then going to apply blush and this is the Milani blush, this is my favourite one at the moment. 
and then I'm going to wipe away my bake with the Anastasia Beverly Hills contour palette with the banana shade and the lightest shade and this is going to brighten up this area I'm then going in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills illuminator in the shade So Hollywood and applying this on the high points of my face. I'm also going to apply it under my brows and in the inner corner of my eye just to make my eye shadow pop a little bit more. And then I'm going to do my eyeshadow under my eye using Stark and Anaheim just for a subtle, smoky definition. I'm then going to apply my roller lash mascara just to my bottom lashes, and that's the eye look finished. I then decided I wanted to add some fork, fork, however you say it, fake freckles. And I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Brow Powder Duo in the shade Soft Brown, I believe, on a very small eyeliner brush. And I'm just going to yeah, draw some freckles on my face. I'm then taking what was ever left on the brush from when I did under my eyes. And I'm just going over the freckles to sort of blur them out a little bit and not be so strong. Make it look a little bit more natural. I'm then going to apply my NYX Soft Suede Lipstick in the shade Sandstorm. This is my perfect nude at the moment. And then I'm going to go in with my NYX Dewy Finish Setting Spray. Apply this all over my face and that is the eye look done. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one, thanks.